Hey y'all, it's Bear with bearindependent.com and we're stacking firewood for grandma. And I just wanted to talk to you guys really quick about the difference between a cord of wood and a rick of wood. Now, if we need to go ahead and establish my bona fides, my bona fides, I have been running a chainsaw and cutting firewood for the last 21 years. I owned a tree company. I cut timber, both saw logs and firewood logs. My first year in business at the age of 17, I split 96 cords by hand. My second year in business at the age of 18, I split 192 cords by hand. My third year in business, I bought a freaking log splitter. But that's why uh, we got the big shoulder arm things. It's from making this. So a cord is four foot wide, four foot high, eight feet long. It's 128 cubic feet, if my math is correct and if my memory serves. A rick is whatever the guy on the corner of the road or over there at the end of that dirt road or up on the side of the hill or wherever says it is. A rick is not a uniform unit of measure. There's no definition for a rick. A cord, again, four foot by four foot by eight foot, 32 square foot stacked four foot high, so that's 128 cubic feet. The reason I bring this up is in this part of the world, Arklatexahomas, wood is sold by the rick. Now, a rick is anywhere around here anywhere between a quarter of a cord, although most commonly a third of a cord, or what we would call a face cord, more on that in a minute, to a half of a cord. So if you're getting a rick for say $40 pickup, and it's a quarter of a cord, that means your cost per cord is 160 bucks. If it's a third of a cord, your cost per cord is 120 bucks. If it's a half a cord, your cost per cord is only 80 bucks. Well, 160 is literally twice 80 because a quarter is twice, or I'm sorry, a half is twice a quarter. I know, the math, it's tremendous, believe me. So it matters. What you're getting matters. And because a rick is not a standardized unit of measurement, it's purely subjective. You know, are you paying $160 per quarter or 80 bucks per cord? It has been my experience that mostly a rick is a third of a cord or a face cord, meaning that it is one row that's eight feet long, four foot high, of approximately 16 inches deep. So a cord tends to be, if your firewood is cut 16 inches long, because 16 times three is 48 inches as far as the depth of the pile, a standard cord is 16 inch deep pieces, three rows that are eight foot wide, four foot high, or one row that is four foot high, 24 foot long. Yeah, cause math, cause math. So a cord, again, is a standardized unit of measurement and the, the unit of measurement for firewood and the one that I would encourage you to deal in a rick is highly subjective, which is why we stack our firewood in eight foot long rows so that we know how many cords we have because a rick doesn't exist. Although it tends to be about a third of a cord. But as we've already seen, that about matters. You want to spend 80 bucks a cord or 160 bucks a cord with our hypothetical numbers. So, as always, I would encourage you to go out here into the world, out there into your world, and do the things. Go swing your axe, go make firewood, go run chainsaws, go, you know, get hair on your chest, unless you're a lady, in which case you should probably have that removed uh, with a laser or something. I don't know how they do it these days. Wax. I don't have that issue. My chest hair grows into my beard. No biggie. It's, it's tremendous, believe me. Literally, go swing your axe. Shalom, y'all.